Let's install Torch CL. Let's install it on the Mac first. We'll cover Windows installation in about 30 seconds. Step one is to download the software. All right, I'm just gonna double click on this file, unzip it and move it to my applications folder. Step two is to set the path. This is so you can use Torch CL from any directory. I have an article about this on the knowledge base and I never remember this command, so I'm just gonna copy and paste it. That's it, let's cover Windows. Just like the Mac, the first step is to download the software. Unlike the Mac, you have a decision to make. If you have Python installed, you can download the source. This will allow you to modify the program. However, I don't have Python installed. I just want it to work. So I'm just gonna download the compiled version. If you're unsure about which version you want, this is the version you should download. Okay. Now just open the zip file and copy the folder onto your drive. I'm going to copy it directly onto the C drive and rename it TorchCL. Now just like the Mac, I'm going to set the path. It's a little different on Windows. It's basically a setting instead of something you type into the terminal. So it's your My Computer's Properties, Advanced Tab, and the environmental variables. The variable I want to set is called path, and I installed Torch CL on the C drive, so that's the path I'm going to enter. Now it's time to configure Torch CL. Torch CL basically works by communicating with Torch's webhook. By just downloading the software, Torch CL has no idea what that is, so you need to set this setting. Note that you will only need to set this once, and the setting is per user account. Okay, back on the Mac, step one is to get my webhook. That's easy, just go to the help section of your Torch account, select integration, and copy the URL. Note you can use any of Torch's webhooks. Which one you should use really depends on what you want to do, but Torch CL itself is completely indifferent. Now in the terminal, type Torch CL dash dash webhook, Put the webhook in and put it with quotes. That's it. The webhook is now saved. If you want to change the webhook later, you can type in the same command again. Let's do the same thing on Windows. Again, let's get the webhook. Okay, that's copied. Open the command prompt and type in torch cl dash dash webhook, put the webhook in there, and place the quotes around it. You'll notice that this process of installing the webhook is identical on both Mac and Windows. This is intentional. Torch CL is a single program written for all operating systems. So if something works on one platform, it'll also work on all other platforms. There you go. Now Torch CL is installed. You're ready to get automated.